Hi guys, and welcome back to my channel. Um, I'm happy to announce to you that um, the bad lighting won't kind of be around too much longer because my husband, who's incredibly supportive of practically everything that I do, has decided that I need a decent webcam. So because he is such a detailed oriented person, he's now researching the best webcams that he can find for me. So I just wanted to put that out there. I also wanted to apologize for my lousy manicure. I really should have had my nails done yesterday, but <clears throat> fact of the matter is it was so nice out yesterday that I couldn't bring myself to sit for two hours in a nail spa while the weather was just so gorgeous. I mean, there's a sprinkling of green on the trees now. I swear, I'm not lying to you. I almost made my husband pull over when we were driving through Valley Forge Park yesterday so I could hug a tree. <coughs> How crazy is that, right? But anyway, I'm here today with a review of, hold on a second. <clears throat> I have a frog in my throat and <clears> throat> I need to hydrate myself. I'll be right back, okay? Hold on. Okay, I'm back. Mommy had water. So anyway, the wig that I'm reviewing today is Mia by Tressalore. And I know she looks very familiar to another wig that I love, but this is not going to be a comparison video. So let me talk about this. Now, this is by Tressalore, and the shade is Mocha Gold. And what I love about this shade, look how beautiful it is. Like you can see the specks of gold running through. Um, it's one of those universally flattering shades. You got a little warmth, you got a little cool. So basically, this color looks great on everybody. Um, next is the wig itself. I love the layers, not gonna lie, the layers in this are astounding. Um, <clears throat> one of the other things that I wanna bring up before I show you how she looks and I take her off is the fact that um, she looks much better in real life than in the stock photo. Mm. And that's like, that's basically my main issue with practically every wig company. The stock photos never really give you an idea of how these wigs are going to look in real life. Um, you've got their studio lighting as opposed to my crappy lighting. You have a model who's young as opposed to this old face. You have basically models that have pretty symmetrical faces. I've got weird eyes. I've got uneven lips. So basically, this wig looks a lot different on the average older woman than it does in the stock photo. Plus, the way that they have these wigs styled in the stock photo really doesn't give you an idea of how the wigs look in real life. So anyway, there's a lot of layering going on here. And I love the way that Tressalore layered this because it's a very natural look. It's, <clears throat> it's a nice full wig without being too big. So if you kind of shy away from like the big, big hair, <clears throat> this is great because it basically has a kind of multitasking vibe going on. You can actually kind of smooth her down if you don't like a big fluffy look or you can mess her up a bit if you're kind of like me. <coughs> I think it might be the air <clears throat> in our home because the heat's been acting wonky due to the weather. And it seems that every time I go to talk a lot, <clears throat> I get a frog in my throat, but anyway, I'm gonna show you how she looks 
from side to side and in the back, and then I'll take her off, okay? So here we go. Here's my right side. You can see the layers. She's looking really good. Here's my left side. Can you get, can you get a flare? And hold on, here's the back. The wave pattern and the layers are pretty astounding in this. And um, I wore her quite a few times this week and she just like stays perfectly put with these waves. I don't have to run to the ladies room and start playing with her. I can just sit in my happy little cubicle all day long and know that when I leave the office at five o'clock, she looks just as good as she did at eight, 30 in the morning. Hold on, I'm going to take her off. Now I did wear a wig cap with her, <clears throat> but I've actually gone wig capless and she's fine. Now here we have a great lace front, which is precision cut. We've got a pretty wide mono part. So there's some room to work with as far as the part goes. Here's the wefting. And what can I say? We have Velcro straps. I freaking love the Velcro straps. I think that they work better than the bra strap kind. So, I mean, overall, this is really one great wig. The ear tabs have slight wire. They're super comfortable for glasses. Like if you wear glasses, nothing's gonna bother you. Overall, this is really a great wig. I'm going to turn her right side out. Look at that wave pattern. I mean, the wave pattern and the layering is great. This is really one outstanding piece of fake hair. Look at that. And there's the color. I'll move her out a little so you can get a better look. Hold on, I'm gonna put her on. Oh, and the thing is, this wig is a little on the larger side, which is great because she accommodates the larger head, but with the Velcro straps, you can make her a lot smaller as well, and she's still gonna be super comfortable. There we go. Let me just pull her over a little. And there you have it. This is Tressilar's Mia. And honestly, I think um, the brand pulled a winner out of their creativity bag because I think Mia is wonderful. And I do have a couple of Tressilor wigs that I like, but this, this wig makes me so intrigued about the brand that I want to have more Tressalore in my life. Like really, this is really, this is great. And um, I might add that even though you can make her big, she's on the lightweight enough side so that this definitely can be worn in the summer. This is not your one season wig. This is definitely a four seasoner. So I think out of the bag, she's great or out of the box, she's great. Um, give her a try. If you're looking for something that is wavy and beachy and has layers, Mia is a great wig and the length is beautiful. If you are of the older generation and you don't want something that's too long, I mean, trust me, I'm a proponent of long hair at any age, but if you want something that isn't super long. Mia, like Mia fits the bill. So that is it. I will be back later and you have a good time. Have a good day. I hope that it's not raining where you are. And that is it. Take care and bye-bye.